hey guys welcome back to my channel it's Ashoni here today we are going to be talking about work clothes someone asked me to do a video about work clothes here in japan so i'm gonna be doing like a very short to the point video and then i'm gonna do a follow-up video where i go in depth so the first thing I, that i want to tell you guys japan has four seasons but i would say they have three seasons so for example or maybe two so this is like a very simple sweater that i wear to work so i have them in many different colors so i have the pink the mustard the brown sweater i have black red green all different colors i have of these if you get a sweater you can wear it during the winter autumn spring when it's winter you can get like a under shirt a very simple undershirt like a thermal type of thing to keep to help you with the heat put this over it you wear a jacket and then you have your coat for the winter i also have these thick cardigans which i wear during the winter i can also wear these during the spring and autumn this is another one that i also wear in japan all the japanese they dress the same so they're gonna be in black or navy blue with sometimes a white inner shirt both males and females so you as a foreigner you are the one that will be bringing some color into their lives so as long as you dress in a professional manner it should be fine at school the teachers when they're teaching they actually wear gym looking attire this is the closest picture that i could find i don't want you guys to picture something that is tight that's not what i'm talking about and this is not for every school and for some schools they allow you to change so at my school i have my own changing ear my own locker where i can put my coat my cardigans whatever i want to but for me i don't see the need to change like whenever i go to school so whatever i wear to school that's what i teach in but for the teachers they usually wear their gym looking attire the entire day and then if there's like an event at school where like for example they have like parents coming over or they have like a meeting then you see them change into their jackets and all of that whatever you wear in jamaica or wherever you're from you can wear it here in japan if it's a professional looking attire anything that you can wear to an interview you can wear it to school and you are encouraged to look professional at all times so whatever you feel if you don't know what professional means you can always go on google and look for interview looking outfit so very simple so I, like i said i'm going to be going in depth um in like a further video where i'm going to show you guys like simple things that i wear in summer i already show you guys what i wear in winter autumn spring these that i wear when i'm going outside i put my coat so that i am not cold i have my gloves and all of that in japan you don't really worry about um how you look you're gonna encounter two types of people here the ones that will be staring at you regardless of how you look or how you dress because you're a foreigner and then you have the other ones who don't give a damn they're just going about their business and they don't care about you so dress however you feel comfortable and you're good to go like i said just ensure that you are dressing in a, in a professional manner in japan people don't usually show cleavage so for example like how i have my sweater even even in summer when it's super super humid i still try to cover up i don't think i've ever seen like a japanese person showing their breasts i don't recall i need to, i need to have i i don't think i don't recall seeing that just a tip for you guys if you're gonna be buying clothes to come here ensure that you're not buying anything that will be revealing your breasts your cleavage because that's like a big no-no here in japan i think you would get away with wearing like a very short dress or a very short skirt but 
the cleavers thing nobody will say anything unless you have like really shitty employees it's better to be safe than sorry anyways that's it for this video guys very short to the point thumbs up this video subscribe turn on the notification bell so that you get notified whenever i upload a new video subscribe 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 please anyways bye guys